How to deal with difficult people is going to be one of the biggest challenges that you're going to have in your life. Because if you don't get the wrong people from around your circle, it's only going to lead to your downfall. A lot of your success is about having quality people in place that can help you and taking the people out of your life that will harm you. Now, for a lot of you guys, you might have had a hard upbringing. You know, some of the negative people in your life might have consisted of your family members, some of them your friends, and you feel obligated to these people. Let me tell you something. When it comes to your success and your vision and your passion, don't be a slave to anybody else. You, gotta, you have to have enough wisdom and you have to have enough drive to say, even if I didn't grow up in the best community, even if I didn't have the best influences around me, there's something beyond this. There's something that's better out there for me. Don't allow yourself to get pulled down by difficult people, right? You got to know how to cut people out of your circle. That might sound hard for a lot of you to do because you want to be friendly with everybody. You want to be the life of the party. You want everybody's acceptance. You want everybody's validation. But I'm telling you, the people that have achieved great things in this world, they did not do it by kissing everybody's behind. They did not do it by being accepted or loved by so many people. Some of the greatest people were actually mocked by many people, rejected by people, a lot of times even hated by other people. So you got to know how to go against the grain. The greatest people in the world, they understood their thought process wasn't like everybody else. And so when you're coming up in a background where everybody is against you, or even at, when you're at your job and you're dealing with difficult people, here's some of the best ways to handle that situation. First and foremost, strategize, 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 strategize to get yourself out of that situation. You know, it's one thing if you find yourself in a situation dealing with difficult people and you find yourself in an environment that's out of your control. But if you are able to change your circumstances and you still stay around difficult people, then you only have yourself to blame. So first you need to come up with a strategy on how do I get myself in a better environment? Maybe you're at a job right now dealing with difficult people. Okay, well the strategy is this. Let's work on getting a new job. Maybe let's work on getting a new position so that way you don't have to deal with the same people. See, you, have, you always have to think about how can I change my environment to stay away from difficult people, right? When you're talking to people and they are always coming at you with tension or when they are always coming at you with negative energy, it's your personal responsibility to move those people out of the way. Keep people around you that want to see you succeed in life because you need good people in your presence. You need good people in your circle. You can't do it by yourself. And if you're a difficult person yourself, you got to stop doing that. The greatest people in this life, they were always about other people. They always knew how to bond with people, how to be able to create relationships, real relationships, not nothing superficial. Okay, so guess what? If you find yourself in a situation where maybe you have um, friends that are difficult, family members that are difficult, loved ones that are difficult, sometimes you got to know when to put your foot down. You know, you can't allow yourself to be taken advantage of. You can't allow yourself to just, you know, be so weak willed that people will, you know, run over you and trample over you. Because I'll tell you, there's a lot of people, difficult people, a lot of times are like Rottweilers and pit bulls. They will try to keep a preeminence and they will try to stake their claim over you and they will not respect you until you put your foot down. Some of those people, guess what? You might have to have one conversation where you just give them a very firm talk and let them know you're not the one. Some other people, you're just gonna have to have that talk and then cut them out. So when you're dealing with difficult people, you got to give them the message up front. You got to tell them this is what it is. And either they can change their ways and you guys can come to a better agreement. Or guess what? Just be willing to go separate ways. You won't die. It won't be the end of the world. I promise you. But if you let difficult people stay in your life, it will be like a cancer to you.
Understand what I'm saying to you. Having difficult people in your life, willfully, that will be one of the worst decisions that you can make. Even if it's a loved one where you say, you know what? I don't want to get rid of this person completely. You got to know how to keep people at a distance because if they're not for you, you're in bad shape. In this life, you need people that are for you, not against you. Okay? So make sure that you subscribe to my channel because I'm going to talk all about things that I wish I was taught growing up about life, success, how to maneuver around bad situations. You know, a lot, I had to learn through a lot of sticky situations after being homeless, after finding myself in failed relationships on how to be able to really maneuver and survive. You know, none of us should have to go through a life that's harder for ourselves than it really has to be. But all of us will encounter difficult people. I found myself, you know, because a lot of times I like to be a pretty easygoing guy. I found myself in situations where I've had to, you know, um, show a different side of myself that make, lets people know, hey, don't take my kindness for weakness. You know, and sometimes you can be very nice about that. Like sometimes I'll tell people to kind of separate themselves from me in a nice way. And if that doesn't work, well then, hey, guess what? Sometimes you gotta put your foot down. But here's one thing that I won't do as an adult. I will not allow difficult people to come in my way and stop what God is giving me. And that's what difficult people will always do. Some people will do it out of envy. Some people will do it out of contention. Some people will do it out of misery. They see your life going in one direction and they want to stop you from achieving your greatness. And I refuse to let anyone stop me from where I know that God is taking me, if it be his will. So that's why I want to give this encouragement to you. Know how to deal with difficult people. Know how to arm yourself against the enemies in this life right this is a war that you are in in this life life is war and it's up to you to decide how you're going to guard yourself and shield yourself from the dangers to come